hi guys welcome back to my channel so today's video I'm gonna be doing a what's in my bag a before and after so if you want to see what's in my big ass bag and then you want to see what's in my after purse because there's a difference the first one is a bag and the other one is a purse so with that being said if you want to see what's going down then just keep on watching I don't even know if I should say this anymore like come on um I got my drink <laughs> so today I'm drinking a Starbucks um, it's just like a little left but I wanted to enjoy it and sip the last of it because it's a little bit watered down um, but it's okay so it, I've been having it for more than three hours I drank um half of it a while ago and then i started drinking the rest when i started doing my makeup so yeah let's take a sip before i show you guys what's in my before bag i'm gonna show you what my before bag looks like and what's in there and all that stuff this is my before purse or my bag because it's a bag um it's like not even a purse but yeah, so this is what I've been using. Um, I got it at Walmart. It was on sale for $7. And I got it because it was so soft. And it came with like a little keychain um, plushie right here. But I took it off because I liked it a lot. I didn't want it to get messed up. So I added it to my collection right there. And this bag is already so messed up. So dirty. And um, I decided that I'm going to use this bag when I ship out like any giveaways so yeah now let me show you what's inside it's busted in there and um there's a lot of receipts in here and I have a thing for collecting receipts I don't throw them away right away it doesn't matter where the receipt is from I don't know like I hoard receipts and I was this close to throwing them away but then I realized no I should show what's in my before bag before I show the other purse so I'm gonna try to show you as best as I can um look there is like literally lots of receipts even a bag look at there's a lot of junk in here literally I'm not even lying this is the purse that I've been using like for my everyday so it's just like a bunch of junk coupons um, a bunch of receipts and this bag and this little pink bag that came with the purse um a wallet i have a big ass <laughs> sharpie <laughs> what the heck <laughs> this black wallet there's nothing in it i already took everything out and then lollipops for when my baby is like throwing a fit because he wants a candy and i hate buying him candy all the time so i always try to keep like little candies in my purse like a stash so then i show him that and then he doesn't want the other candies so that's the secret just keep like little candies if you don't want to buy your kids like more candy at the store and then you just show them and they forget that they want the other candy so that's what I do some movie receipts the laundry coin card um, that's where I wash my white blankets because um, the one that we have here where I live does not get the job done right so I like to take it to the laundry mat where it is where it's actually gonna like wash it and um, I've been thinking if I should film a video of how I wash um, my blankets because I do have a white blanket for my bed and um, yeah like I like to take care of it girl I got rent receipts in here but y'all don't gotta see that so I'm not even gonna show you guys but yeah, I got my rent receipts in here. And um, I keep all of my rent receipts. Um, I keep the little um, tag from the money order. And I also keep the receipt that they give you from like where you got it from. So like I keep all my receipts when it comes like to paying the rent. Because yeah, like you never know. You just really never know. But uh-uh, I can't risk it. Oh, I found a little piece of gum. Um, this is like the pineapple one this is a pineapple gum I think it's I'm not sure I think it's trident it comes in the yellow package and it's pineapple it's bomb but um, I should just throw it back in there. and yeah that's all everything in here is just 
so this is like literally the receipt to my rent and then um where's the little stuff let me see if i can find it not that you guys need to know all of that like seriously that's like nobody's business like or you know like not nobody cares about this but you never know maybe you're the type that leaves your papers around like i used to do that I used to leave like all my rent receipts like wherever and then I always think I was going to remember but I would never remember. So this is like the receipt that I get from getting them from purchasing the money order and then this is the ticket to the uh, money order and then you could just staple them and then I throw them like in a little drawer container that I have with all the other ones. So um, of course I am going to keep this after I clean it out because I'm not going to throw everything away. I will keep be keeping some receipts from in here. Dollar Tree, that's like my favorite spot for my decor. And that's it. That's all I have in here. Ooh, I hit my nose. So are you guys ready to see my um, after purse? I just literally got this purse yesterday. I feel like this purse is a mom purse. Um, there's nothing wrong with that, you know. Like you have your mom purse, you have your going out purse, you have your little, um, what your hangover purse that go, like I don't I don't know the one you throw to the side, you know, uh, for different occasions. But this purse, it's like a mom purse to me. Um, but yeah, I don't know if that makes sense. So, I get it. I get what I'm saying. But I just got this purse yesterday and it still has the tags because I wanted to show you guys how much I paid for this purse. It was not that expensive. It was pretty cheap and um, I usually don't like paying more than $40 for a purse. I told you guys I'm a big old cheapo and I was like, yeah, no, I was actually like on a budget. I did not want to spend more than $20, but I did go a little bit over $20, but... I was like, it's okay. This is kind of like what I'm looking for. Let me show you guys um, my purse. I just got it yesterday because I really needed a purse anyways. And this was like a perfect excuse. Me filming this video was even like a more perfect excuse to get a new purse. So let me show you guys. i obsessed with it. Um, and I did add some little detail of my own. I'm not going to show you guys the price yet. I should just take it off so you guys don't see it. So I can just show you when I'm ready. So this is a, my new purse. I, I couldn't decide. There was like three purses that I really liked. But this one, this one was the winner because of the color and all of the space in this purse. And let me just show you guys that I actually added these little um keychain plushies plushies they're hearts i love collecting um these little plushy things as you can see i have a collection right there and i also have another collection and i don't know i'm just obsessed with collecting these and i thought it would go perfect with my purse and um this is like a no brand purse the designer is kathy ireland and then it has it right here. I'm just going to give you guys like a little bit detailed of a little bit detailed of the purse. Um, here's her picture. I don't know if you guys watch Hallmark movies. Um, you guys might have seen her. I've seen her in a few movies. And the purse says a vegan leather. So I don't know how important that is to you guys. And I guess the retail price for whatever store like or the like if they're selling it like at a different retail it's like 128 i don't know how true that is but that's what it's the tag says i don't know it's just like oh what the heck so let me cut it off like i don't even know why i was holding it when i could have just cut it off oh it wasn't the way of us duh so it says vegan leather and then the retail price is supposed to be supposedly 128 I don't know how true that is. And this is the designer of the purse. She's beautiful. And I've seen her do um, like some Hallmark Christmas movies. And I just love um, those movies that she made on Hallmark. They come out every year during Christmas. Now I'm going to tell you guys how much I actually paid for this purse. And then I'm going to show you guys what I put in it and 
hopefully it can stay this organized from now on hopefully so the price that I paid was $24.99 so I paid $25 plus tax I'm not exactly sure because I did end up getting like some books too for my baby or for my kids and I think the total with taxes the purse would have been like 26 something so yeah that's not expensive at all for a purse I'm happy with this purse like I love it so much it has the handles like you can hold it like this or you it has the strap so you could put it on the side like I'm obsessed with this purse like it's crazy like I couldn't stop on looking at it last night I couldn't stop touching it like I was I just couldn't wait to put um my stuff in here so now i'm going to show you what's in my purse or what did i put in here and there's a lot of like a lot of, of space in here there's a lot of um how do you say it like compartments i'm gonna just say compartments like to put stuff in here it's very spacious and i'm happy that i'm, I'm finally gonna have like a little spot for my phone because on the other purse it would always get lost i could never find it and um, I freaking hated it. Like, I just want to grab it. So, the first um, compartment I'm going to show you is this one right here. Right here. The zip, it has a zipper. Let me show you. There, like that. And what I have in here is my chapstick. Some gum. I better whisper because the baby. If you want it. And then my floss because... I'm obsessed with flossing after I eat. That's like a must for me. I always floss after I eat. So these are like the three things I have in the main compartment in the front. So I'm always, it's like always easy for me to reach for them. And then I'm just going to close it so nothing falls out. And then this is the main part of the bag. It has like this clip right here, like this part. And then I'm going to show you like how spacious it is inside. So I decided to add a notebook in here so that every time I want to film something or have an idea, I want to make sure that I always have somewhere to write it down instead of just putting it on my phone all the time. So I have this notebook. It's Marilyn Monroe. It's so cute. And it says, I just want to be wonderful. Oh my God. I bought it at the dollar store. I haven't used. Oh yeah, I did use it already. I wrote some stuff in here. So I have my pink wallet and I got this at Walmart for $5. It's so cute. It looks like that black one that um, I showed you guys in the other purse. But just looking at it, just looking at it pink, it's just so cute. Like I got so bored of that black one and it was time for me to get a new wallet anyways. But I just really like how it looks in pink and um, yeah, so I have my wallet and then I also have this little travel wallet um i like to use this one for my id like if i'm gonna go out and i don't want to carry my whole purse i will only carry this um little wallet and i'll put my id in here so i decided to keep it in my purse it's so sparkly look and i got this at the dollar store as well it's so cute for my purse pocket change coin collector thing and it's so cute look how it's i don't know if it's pink or purple or what but i really liked it i felt like it went with everything else and i was supposed to put the coins in here but i ended up putting them in a jar so yeah i have this for my purse because i don't like them all i really want to try to keep this everything organized so that's why i got like a little bit something of everything because i know i'm going to use it and let me see what else I got in here. Oh, and then I got um, all of, right here in this little pouch is plastic. I have all of my kids and my um, insurance cards and our uh, social security cards and stuff. So I keep everything together. I like to keep it in this pouch at all times. So I just go and reach it. And honestly, like, I've been thinking of taking it out. But I'm just so used to having it in here that it's staying in here. And let me see what else I got in here. And then I got my pen for my book. And look how cute this pen is. It's like a royal blue and it has like these little crystals in there. 
and then it has like a the little um, plasticky for your phone but it doesn't work on my phone it's so rough like it's not soft like it doesn't feel jelly enough so I don't even use it but I do like how the pen writes and I like the little um, crystals in there and then we have a pink lighter because you never know so we have a pink lighter she's cute so when I saw this pink lighter, I snatched it so quick. It was the last one. So you never know. And then I have this little box right here. It's also pink. And I wanted everything in my bag to be pink because we're still doing the pink series. So that's why I decided to do all pink everything. But the donuts, um, cupcakes, and yeah, look how cute it is. And it's a little compartment box. You open it. And I have my business cards in there. And I'm going to tell you guys what they say. It says, J and my last name, positive vibes only. Because this year, it's just been all about the positive vibes. I decided this year that I don't care like anymore that I was going to let go of all the negativity. And I don't know, like, it's just weird. Like it's something like you just have to do oh my god ouch <laughs> i tell you guys i keep hurting these nails no joke i decided to put positive vibes only on my business cards because that's just been like a big thing to me this year uh, starting this year i decided no more like positive vibes only but it started it like with myself positive vibes only this year has just like been a big deal so that's why i put positive vibes only and they're so cute they have like eyes and then eyelashes with some red lips i got them on um, vista print so yeah positive vibes only you guys and um there is oh let me show you the inside of the bag so this is the inside of the bag. There's like a lot of space. These two bags right here. The another zipper. And then this part. And then it has another zippy part in the back. And you guys, I'm so obsessed with this purse. Like for $25. And the, the quality, like it doesn't feel cheap. Like I really like it. Like I said, I'm not like... Um, how do you say it like a name brand person bag so yeah like i'm happy with this like i i love this purse so much and it has like these little detailing at the bottom which i appreciate because sometimes i hate when my purses like touch like the table or i feel like they get messed up and this kind of like protects it like it helps it like stand up better so i really like this detailing right here and it has the designer's name on here the detailing right here is really nice as well and it has like some black detailing on the side with the gold and i also carry pepper spray with me but i um i didn't have it in my purse but pepper spray look how cute it's glittery and i got it at walmart i think it's like five or six dollars and it's locked and then you just twist it or i mean turn it like this and spray it and i never had to use it but i will if i have to do not and yeah i was like i need like something to make sure i'm safe so you just oh, twist it or turn it i mean and press it down so yeah like if ever if i ever have to run to the store for emergency real quick and i'm stepping out of the house like quick um i like i already have it prepared like i'll hold it like the way i'm supposed to just in case and bam do not i'll pepper spray your ass <laughs> i'm not kidding my husband got me this because i told him i need something to protect myself so yeah you guys get you guys self get yourself pepper spray because you never know and what do you guys think about this hair in this makeup like my makeup came out really 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 good today i don't know what i did different but it came out really good i really don't know what i did different today i don't know what's the foundation but this is one of my favorite foundations and i also mixed it with another foundation and i'm going to show you which one it is because that's like it's the only 
right thing to do i used the maybelline liquid mousse airbrush finish and then i added a drop of the cover effects and these are the two foundations i mixed together and i don't know if it's the foundation or the way i set my makeup or what but my foundation looks really really good today it's crazy yeah like my foundation looks really good but um yeah let's put everything back in my purse like you guys wanted to see now you guys are gonna help me put it in there i never carry um extra makeup with me i never carry powder or nothing like i i don't like i never retouch my powder i never have to do anything i don't even carry lip gloss with me but i should start to carry lip gloss with me because a few nights ago not a few nights ago actually um like last weekend i did go out and my lip gloss ended up drying and i didn't even take no extra lip gloss with me and i regretted it so for now on i will start to carry like a lip gloss with me or something like that like a little something but no powders or face makeup or anything just um lip gloss like i never have to retouch my um my face makeup it just stays the same all day so i'm hoping that i'm able to keep up because all i can think of is okay what am i gonna do when i'm in a rush like am i really gonna like put it back in the little compartment or, not, or am i just gonna throw it in there i'm already worried about what i'm gonna do when i use something like that's all i can think of all i think of is oh crap am i really gonna keep up I'm going to keep my pepper spray, my lighter, and my pen together so it all fits perfect. And then um, I should buy like a little makeup baggie for the lip glosses and stuff so I don't just throw it in there because um, the whole purpose of me getting a purse is so that I'm able to stay organized. And you know what they say that your life is just as organized as your purse and that's not my case. Like. Um, I, I still need to get like my life together um yeah no for me yeah no i still need to organize a lot of stuff with that being said you guys that is it for this video and thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video and i will see you guys on my next one bye